So I decided to try something new with my camera and I don't think I like it. I have it sitting right in front of my face. The drawing's more clear, which is good, but I have the camera so close to the picture I can barely see it while I'm inking it right now, so it kind of sucks. I'm trying to like look around. <laughs> Anyways, this is another one of my character descriptions. I did decided to do some um, bad guys because there's just as many of them as good guys, but everyone usually focuses on the good guys. But anyways, I thought this one would just be really short and maybe fun to do because these are my version of trolls and there's a lot of them and they're definitely bad guys. Um, they kind of are just naturally bad uh, they work for Poisonberry she's the main bad guy and she's really smart and they're very dumb it's like a part of their character they're extremely dumb so she can manipulate them really easy and make them do whatever she wants them to uh, most of them are pretty generic uh, a lot there's like a whole army of these guys so at times there will be a bunch of them together and you can't really tell them apart they all have black hair and green skin uh, my comic's gonna be in black and white but uh, yeah <laughs> if, if, if I ever do colored images they have green skin some of them have different shades so they're like a little bit darker but they're all pretty much the same. They're really dumb. They're all buff. They're not very tall. They're about the average height of the average elf, which in my comic, all the elves and trolls are like just a little bit shorter than humans. And um, yeah, they're pretty interchangeable. There's none that really stick out except the little guy because he's like a little kid and he's been working for Poisonberry pretty much his whole life. So he He's not completely stupid. He's not definitely not smart, but um, he has a big mouth, so he's always talking. He's usually the one who does all the talking for the rest of them because the rest of them can just grunt and they kind of talk like almost like cavemen, how you see cavemen in movies where they just say like, oh, shut up, like one or two syllables. They can't speak in full sentences except the little one but he's not necessarily smart he's just the only one that really stands out because he's small and he wears a helmet um i kind of have fun with him well my ideas for him he kind of interrupts people and while they're talking so it's kind of funny and I've always had this idea since I started this comic idea of him having the biggest axe. They all use axes and clubs and primitive weapons, so I thought it would be funny if he carried the biggest axe since he's the smallest guy. But yeah, that's the trolls in a nutshell. Thanks for watching.